Number 69. Determine whether aqueous solutions of the following salts are acidic, basic, or neutral. And then we have aluminum nitrate, which is AlNO33. Well, this is pretty simple to do. All salts are, are just ionic compounds. So they have a metal, in this case aluminum, and in this case the polyatomic nitrate, right? So all we have to do is just break this down into its two ions. The split is between the aluminum and the nitrate. This goes back to like the beginning of Gen Chem 1. So we have aluminum, which would be a 3 plus charge, and the nitrate, which would be NO3 minus. Now, in this case, we don't really have to get the compounds right. We just have to kind of make the match. Now, since we're talking about aqueous solutions, aqueous is always in terms of water. So what you're going to do is you're going to make conjugates of these ions and see what's going on. With your positive, you're always going to add the hydroxide OH from H2O, and the minus, the negative, that's the, you know, could be the base, so you add a hydrogen on there. So this will be basically aluminum with an OH, and then for the NO3, you have HNO3. Okay. From here, we decide if any of these are acidic, or uh, not acidic, if these are strong acids or bases. That's the easiest way to go about this question. So let's see. HNO3. I go on my list of strong acids and strong bases, and I notice that HNO3 is one of my six strong acids. So I know that HNO3 is a strong acid. I'll just put SA for strong acid. But the thing here is that if you're dealing with a strong acid, the conjugate is so, 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 so weak that it's basically classified as neutral. The stronger you are, the weaker the conjugate base, and the weaker and weaker and weaker it gets, the more neutral. So since this is the strong acid, what you had before was basically neutral. So this component doesn't really matter for acidity or basicity. Now let's just do the same thing here. Well, now I have an aluminum with the, uh, with the hydroxide. So I'm scanning my six strong bases, and I don't see anything that has to do with aluminum here. There's lithium, uh, sodium, potassium, calcium, strontium, and uh, barium. Aluminum is not one of them. So this can't be a strong base. It would have to be a weak base. And weak bases, the conjugate that you have is also classified as weak, but it's an acid. So you kind of like vice versa it. So since this was a weak base, this positive that you're starting with is basically acidic. And now you just put the two together. Acidic plus neutral is acidic. So this salt would be acidic. And that's the answer for this one. So stay tuned. We got a couple of more. And I hope this helped. Let me know in the comments. Subscribe to the channel. And I'll see you in a little bit. Okay, bye-bye.